Mr. President, only a few days ago, on 15 September, over 20 members of the Baha'i community in Yemen, including all of its national level leaders, were indicted at a court hearing in Houthi controlled Sana'a. The hearing began with only the judge, the prosecutor, and other court official presence. Neither the Baha'is being charged nor their lawyers were informed of the court session. The next hearing is scheduled for 29 September, to which the judge has summoned those absent from the first court session, among them women and a teenage girl. They have been spuriously accused under various absurd pretexts of espionage and apostasy, crimes which carry the death penalty. Mr. President, in its recent reports, the group of eminent experts presented its finding concerning the dire situation of the Baha'i community. It refers to the arbitrary detention of Baha'is purely on the basis of religious beliefs, the rampant violation of due process, the promotion of a propaganda campaign by the leader of the Houthis to incite hatred against the Baha'is, and in January of this year, the sentencing of a Baha'i to death based on charges similar to those being leveled against the Baha'is just days ago. Moreover, the group of experts states that even its request to visit the imprisoned Baha'is has been denied. All of the foregoing confirms that the Houthis' plan to decimate this religious community continues unabated. In fact, there are clear signs that they are accelerating and intensifying their efforts. What is even more worrying is that the manner in which the Houthis are targeting the Baha'i community is eerily reminiscent of the persecution of the Baha'is in Iran in the 1980s, during which leaders of the Baha'i community were suddenly rounded up and killed. In short, there is every reason to be concerned about the immediate safety of the Baha'i community in Yemen. Mr. President, our question to the group of eminent experts is this. Given the present circumstances, what means can be pursued for the Houthis to abandon their escalating campaign of religious persecution? Thank you. Thank you, madam.